guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make Nahari in the Instapot. So what you'll be needing is one kilogram of veal shanks, one cup of whole wheat flour, you can use less if you like the gravy thin, half cup of oil, I will be using the Sean packet uh, masala for Nahari, you can use any other brand you like or your own uh, mixture. You'll also be needing one jug of water and the Instapot. So let's get started. So first we're going to be adding our water into our flour. And then we're going to be mixing it until there's no clumps, then we're going to leave it on the side. First we're going to put our Instapot on saute mode. So first we're going to add our oil. And then we're gonna add our meat. Now we're gonna add in our masala. You can use less if you would like your nahari to be less spicy. Now we're gonna mix it. We're going to fry this for about 5 minutes. If you see that the masala is sticking to the bottom, you can add a little bit of water. Once you see that the oil is separating from the masala, we can add the water. So now we're going to add in our water. I'm going to add it to the 9 cup marking. So I filled my water to the 9 cup marking. And now I'm going to put on my lid. Make sure that the valve is on sealing. And now we're going to click the meat button. And we're going to let it cook. Once the countdown is complete, we're going to give it a quick release. Now we're going to open our Instapot. And we're going to give it a quick mix. As you can see, the meat, the meat is nicely cooked and nice and soft. Now we're going to add in our flour mixture and we're just going to give it a quick mix and then we're going to put on our lid. Make sure that it's on the ceiling and then we're going to put on manual for 20 minutes. Once the countdown is complete, we're going to do another quick release. Once the pin is dropped, you can open the Instapot. Mmm, this looks so good. I cannot wait to dig in. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe and share my video.